Do you like pretzels? Do you like them sweet? Do you like them chocolate? Do you like them salty? Never mind that. Let's see how we can draw one. You'll be needing a pen, a pencil and an eraser. To draw a yummy scrummy pretzel, let's start by going up and around like that. And we're going in a kind of a circle. It's like a heart, but without a point at the bottom. And then we can draw this kind of circle shape like that. And very, very gently, let's draw something, an inner kind of circle to give us an idea of the thickness of our pretzel. And then, this is the secret part. <laughs> this bit where it comes around on the top. We want this to do almost like a quarter circle. So if you kind of think of a point there and there, it's kind of like a quarter circle. And then this is gonna come around to meet it at a point. Then, imagine that's coming around, but it's underneath that bit. And that's going to want to come again in a kind of quarter circle. So if that's the point there that you've got your compass or something, it's coming like at a quarter circle there. But then that will go straight on like that. And so will that. And here it really wants to get a little bit sort of thinner as it sort of, you, you kind of pull it out. <laughs> Imagine when it's soft pastry and you're kind of pulling it out before it gets cooked and sort of turns harder. So this line is kind of going on underneath there. And then we're going to want something similar kind of around like that. Join me on Patreon for images, help sheets and a whole lot more. Now before you ink it in, this is going to be covered in salt crystals. And some of those salt crystals will be going over the edge of the line. So try doing some like that. So maybe a bit across there. And they want to be a little bit, let's just finish that there. Because uh, if they're all just inside the line, it doesn't quite look real because it's curving and some will be on the outside. So let's try one there. Um, let's try one right on that spot there. And um, we'll have one over there. You don't want to do too many because you'll make it kind of look like a like a mushroom or something. And we can put a few more in. Don't go totally crazy and spread them out kind of nicely. I think we could have one about there. Certainly one on there, and we need one on there. And then maybe we could do a few kind of smaller little crystals like that. And then we can start drawing so go all the way around the outside stopping when you get to that crystal and stopping there and then stop at that point because here we need to come just slightly curved around and then we can stop at that salt crystal follow around oh that went a bit wobbly but it doesn't matter because <laughs> dough goes a bit wobbly doesn't it i can't quite see because the camera's in the way and that will come around to there and then slightly wobbly there and blobby and slightly wobbly around there and blobby that will go and carry on that will carry on and we'll carry on from that point and we'll take that around to there and that around to there now, when you are absolutely sure that the ink is dry, then you can erase all those pencil lines and no one will know how you did it so perfectly. And then all I'm gonna do is add a little bit of shading. So I'm doing some slightly longer and then sort of getting shorter bits like that. And I'll do the same here, sort of longer, getting shorter, 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 shorter. And then probably something similar there, but just getting away from the edge and we might want to do something just underneath there as well and there and the trouble is you see now once you start doing a bit of shading <laughs> you're never going to stop so i'll just do a little bit more there and i think i might do a little bit just sort of like that and a little bit there a little bit there a little bit there just to give us a little feeling of the curving on the edge of the pretzel, but you don't want to overdo it because you can make it look really messy because it's not a thing that's covered in stripes. If you join me on Patreon, you can see the full video showing how to paint this in watercolor or just color it a lovely toasty brown, add a little bit of shadow, 
and there you are how to draw a pretzel thanks for watching and make sure you are subscribed to draw stuff real easy and keep coming back for lots more drawings every week in the meantime keep drawing 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 practice 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 keep munching and i'll see you next time <laughs> you take care now bye bye